कोई तन धन ते तारा नथी नथी प्रिया परने तो अजी छे बाजी आथ मा माते चेत नर तू चेत ले मित्रता दोस्ती तमारा व्यवार रही जाशे कारण ओ तेरी जी तेरी जी तेरी हार
Akashika from Transact Academy.
the vehemence with which people are fighting, I'm… I was wondering, did I miss something? I think in a very calibrated way, somebody sent the message to the minorities that your citizenship is under threat. This lie did fly for the last one week, now it's landed. Namaskaram Sadhguru. Sadhguru, there is a lot of turmoil in the nation regarding CAA and NRC. I am confused and many of us do not even know what to make out of it. Where did you come from? I am from Lucknow. Oh. <laughs> and there is so much going on. Yeah, I know, Lucknow people are confused <laughs> <laughs> Sadhguru, I wanted to know your thoughts on this. My thoughts, CAB became CAA, a bill became an act. Well, looking at uh, last one week's uh, reactions on the street, I even wondered, have I missed something really? Have I missed some aspect of it? Because I have not read the act fully, I only know it from the newspapers and whatever else is there in the… generally out there. Mm, considering that many explanations that are being put out. See, this was one land, got divided about seventy-two years ago. Terrible things happened, nearly six hundred, seven hundred thousand people got killed, three to four million people migrated from both sides, going through enormous suffering. And the country, at least one part, not India, the other two parts that happened, happened on religious basis. People divided the land on religious basis. Fortunately, we chose to be a secular nation, but the others chose to be, you know, religious republics. But not everybody changed sides because people have been living there for millennia. Not everybody will leave their property, their life, their everything and travel just because the nation… somebody drew a line. Seventy-two years ago, a whole lot of people did not understand what this line meant, really. So quite substantial number of them stayed back. There is a lot of debate about percentages, I am not an expert on this either. They say twenty-three percent stayed back in West Pakistan and nearly thirty percent stayed back in East Pakistan. That's what people say because nobody has perfect numbers I believe, but it's somewhere around that, it can't be totally wrong. But then uh, 1971 war happened and East spread persecution and of the people. They got messed up with the local population situation. Because by law claim there is discrimination, but not by law. Individual people may always discriminate against each other, which is there in every nation on some basis for race, religion, caste, creed, gender, all kinds of discriminations exist unfortunately in most societies on the planet. We are not completely antiseptic to that, we also have our share of discriminatory practices, but not by law. In the eyes of the law, all citizens of India are just same. There is no two ways. Not everything catches up with the constitution, everybody plays their own little game here and there for different reasons, political reasons, social reasons. But on the other side, by law, there are discriminations. Women are seriously discriminated, these are discriminated. Blasphemy, such things are not possible in this. Repercussions that is there everywhere in the world. But John, visiting Baku, with all Sanskrit, it is those who want to do sadhana, 
on fire because of natural gas, naturally on the land there are points where fire is burning or he's been burning forever. So they built a nice temple around that and this is a place they want to go there and spend. You've completely forgotten about those are still going there. So 164 of them came. Well, on that day I had to take 164 photographs with each one of them <laughs> and then families and then friends and groups and